Yeah, like right now, the fact that your boat's in front of mine, we're trying to go for these perfect Get conditions. Get you slow loser. <laughs> If you are here because you just want the answer, you just want to know, is the sloop faster than the brig going directly into the wind? I will save you the time from watching this video. You do not have to watch the whole thing for the end for conclusions or whatever. I'll just tell you right now, the answer is no. In literally every wind condition, going every direction, the brig is faster than the sloop. And if that blows your in mind or you are just you were so sure that that was true and you don't believe me right now you can watch the rest and i'll explain how we tested this we'll show footage from a few of the test runs and uh you can you know question it to the end of the universe in the comments section down below so why are we asking this question at all it's because there is a very common understanding within the community that the brig is faster than the sloop in every wind condition other than into the wind. And that if you square your sails on the sloop and sail directly into the wind, then you can outrun a brig or you can catch a brig that's running in that direction from you, you know, if you're so lucky. You'll hear this everywhere. For example, if you pop over to Reddit and ask, for example, like this post, uh, Guides say the sloop is the fastest in the wind, the brig still catches me, and this person shares the story of being caught by a brig despite knowing that the sloop is faster into the wind. And people respond saying, yeah, the brig is faster in most cases, but technically a sloop is faster when you go straight into the wind. And then a, a long answer explaining uh, you know, how that works. And this person saying there might have been some navigational razzmatazz, which I think is amazing. And it couldn't have been that the brig was faster. And this person going so far as to say, are you sure you're not it and you were saying with the wind not against it op saying i'm absolutely sure uh here's a person saying i'm new in the game and i'm wondering is it possible for a sloop to uh adapt the wind and and outrun a brig sure short answer yes um long answer it's complicated this person saying the same thing with more words yeah the sloop is fast or into the wind another person saying basically the same thing with even more words and then we've got people citing numbers, like the sloop is 100% faster, it's Prig 90, Galleon 70. This person's citing actual speeds. The sloop is 0.5 meters per second faster. And this person taking it to full Reddit and giving us an actually moment. Actually, actually, the sloop is 0.5333 meters per second faster, not 0 0.5. Repeating, of course. Or maybe instead of Reddit, you go into a Twitch stream and you ask the streamer which boat is fastest into the wind or is it possible as a sloop to outrun the bigger boats? And the streamer will almost certainly tell you, yes, it is possible for the sloop to outrun the boats. It is possible for you to outrun the, the brig as a sloop. You can do it. Just go directly into the wind and square your sails or do what we call dummy sails. And I, and I, I know that because I've both asked and as a streamer, I've answered that question that way probably a thousand times for months now, for, for, for over a year now, I've been answering that question that way. So where is this information coming from? Why are we all so sure that in this one specific case, the sloop is faster than the brig when in every other condition, the brig is faster than the sloop, like where are we, what, what numbers are we citing, right? Well, it all goes back to this video from about three years ago that was posted. It has over a million views. It's what I referenced in my stream. It's what most of the streamers I know reference in theirs. It's this video where a member of our community put a ton of effort into creating a pirate GPS and using that GPS, they were able to measure the speeds of different boats while they were sailing in different wind conditions and create an average speed readout. And then with that readout, they compared the different boats with different sail positions in different wind conditions to give us generally a, a sense of in what 
case would a sloop be faster than a brig, be faster than a galleon, or in what cases are, you know, is each boat slower than the other? Amazing, wonderful, super helpful. And up until a few months ago, I, I would just recite this as if it were canon, like as if it were absolutely 100% true. But a few months ago or several months ago, I started noticing that I was getting caught by Briggs when I was trying to reset my boat and repair, uh, even though I was sailing directly into the wind. And I also kept hearing from community members who were having the same thing happen. And on the flip side, there were a few times when I'd be chasing a brig and I'd get super lucky and they would run directly into the wind, which is the worst way for a brig to run from a sloop. And all I ever do is try to try to sink boats. So I'm always chasing people. So I have a lot of personal chasing data and I wouldn't be catching up in those minutes where they were running directly into the wind. I wouldn't make any headway. And I, I started to wonder if this maybe isn't true. So that's where this Sea of Science video came from. We decided to go out and test it ourselves. To test this out, I, I got on a server with my buddy Tallywhacker, who you should absolutely go and follow on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash Tallywhacker underscore. It was just the two of us and we we just set up races, essentially. We would, we would both get our boats oriented directly into the wind and and I'm not it, not just a slight headwind we're talking about sailing exactly where the wind was coming from so if you imagine a compass we were keeping our the wind at exactly zero degrees or if you imagine a clock we were keeping the wind at exactly 12 o'clock the entire time not 11 o'clock not one o'clock 12 o'clock and we were just sailing side by side and we did this a bunch of times we did it going different directions and every test resulted in the same conclusion. So you can watch that footage if you want later in this video, but just know that it doesn't matter which direction we went. And there was only one scenario where the sloop did outpace the brig going into the wind. And spoilers, it's when the brig had their sails wrong. So if the brig doesn't have dummy sails and the sloop does, if the brig sails are all the way to the left or all the way to the right, instead of being straight or square, then the sloop will outpace the brig. But in every other scenario, the brig outpaces the sloop by a tiny amount, but outpaces the sloop. And the sloop never outran the brig. I got to turn a little bit to the right. The wind changed again a little bit or the ocean motion of the ocean twisted us yeah i'm okay. gonna turn just slightly i think we both that drop straight back sail at the same time and then you run and drop front as as quick as possible okay on your word ready set go all right sloop definitely has a lead at the beginning so i'm gonna slow down and, and get us neck and neck here I'm catching already. Oh, that's not okay. All right, I'm gonna go full then. <laughs> yeah, I guess if, if God, if this, no if it, fucking way, dude. Look at this. If it is faster. Dude, we're still going dead wind, right? Oh, we got a little bit of yeah. side. The tiniest oh, it, bit yeah, of side. Yeah, it just changed. Right, it just changed. Crank left a little bit. All right. I mean, I'm definitely not outrunning you right now. No. And you've got dummy sails. So yeah, the wind changed full. All right. I'm going to turn into it and then I'll probably slow down and try to get us neck and neck. It'll just be easier to tell. Are we going okay. into the wind? All right. We are going into the wind right All now. All right. This is it then. This is it. So I'm, oh, I'll use this cannon. Oh, you are, you are outpacing me. You are definitely outpacing me. Because the cannon is about am. to be lined up. I fucking am, dude. dude. Look at that. It's, it's like every With downward wave. wave. Yeah. Yep. Did the wind change again? Not really. Nope. nope. Oh, yeah. So turn a little bit to the left because you're also kind of going away. Or I can turn. No, no. You stay. I'll turn a little bit to the right because the wind. I wasn't going exactly into it. Dude. In no way am I faster. That That's clear. But you 
I that. think are faster right now. Holy shit. And I'm just, I'm at, I'm at center wheel. Yeah, you're definitely outrunning me. That's crazy. Look, the cam my camera is aiming at your, like, back mast now. Yep. I haven't moved my cannon left to right. I need, I need to turn a little bit to the right. A little okay. bit to the right. Yep, me too. Yeah, you're, like, if we were racing to a destination, you're winning right now. Okay. Um, can we get closer? Can you, like, smoosh yeah. over towards me and I'll smoosh towards you? It's a little bit easier to yeah. tell when, when the boats are, like... Like, neck and neck. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna, well, we might uh, bonk. That's fine. Uh, all right. So let's let's run this for a little bit longer once we get closer to each other, and then let's try the side sail thing. Cause it, already you are faster than me. Like look look at this shit. You are a full. You are almost a. F I know. You are in ahead of my boat. I can't even shoot <laughs> you anymore. <laughs> the fuck? Okay, and that's old, a dummy sail. Old Northwest, dead wind. Okay. You're gonna have to slow down so I can catch up because I'm a sloop and I'm going into the wind and that's slower. Um, can you, can, yeah, can you curl sails really quick? Dude. All right, that's good, that's good, that's good. I'm coming over, I wanna come over here a little bit closer. Can we get to where like, we could basically jump to each other's ladders? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Actually, yeah, curl sail again because you're, you're, <laughs> you're outrunning me so fast. I can't even get close enough to you to make this video work. All right, this is fucking ridiculous. This is the difference in speed that it should be. Like, this is how much the sloop, everybody talks about the sloop being able to catch up. This is it. It's, the sloop is faster if the brig is, has its sail one quarter curled, you know? All right, there you go. Mm -hmm. Drop, 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 drop. All right, this is close enough for a good test. We got perfect Already. wind right now. Already, it's, it's gonna fucking creep, dude. All right, I'm watching it's from my cannon. Away. Turn, turn your wheel to the right a little bit. Oh, yep, sorry. Oh, I just got a really bad lag spike. Thank you recording. Uh -oh. Might be harder on my computer than the streaming. Alright. Shit, All right. we just got side a little bit. Okay. Uh, uh, turn let's both turn left. Left. Left, left, left. This will give me a little bit of a lead for a sec, no matter what. So we'll have to reset. Because I'm on, we're going my way, you know? Yeah, we'll mm -hmm. see if you can catch up to me. That'll be interesting. Alright, I'm at. I need to go a little bit to the right for perfect dead wind. Yeah, let's see if you catch up to me. Yeah, you're gaining. Yeah, I'm, yeah you're gaining. I'm you, I was at the tip of your bowsprit before, and now I'm a little bit behind. Dude. With with each down, each down, I'm king. I, I'm I'm pulling ahead. Yep, pulling ahead. Yep. Cause I'm I'm not moving my can. Yeah, look, my. From, I, from my perspective, the cannon is now aiming at the front of your boat. Like, I could probably... I'm not moving it left to right, but I'm moving it up to down. It was at the front... Oh, we're kind of sailing apart from each other, aren't, aren't we, right now? All right. Um, well, that's fucking conclusive, right? Like, oh, yeah, you're definitely yep. gaining. What the oh, yeah. fuck? This is the one wind condition. And this is so unlikely, right? Exactly dead wind. And you're faster. All right, so I'm going to put... I'm putting my, my cannon dead center on your front mast. You're outpacing me. Yeah, you're outpacing me. This is dummy sail on both boats. Birds in front. Birds in front. Okay. I, you're you're outpacing me. You're just. That's, I 100% am. Yep. I'm on my cannon is about to be on your back mass. Like for chain shots, I could have chain shotted your front before from this angle, and now I could chain shot your back. This is still dummy sail. We're still we still got the wind. You're just straight up outrunning me. Start record. Okay, so this is the, like, we're basically just testing the same, like, dummy sails, but this time we're going... Ready? Ready. And go. Yeah, I'm gonna... Actually, I'll just leave it, because if you catch up to me, it's not gonna matter. Alright, so I'm... Very much in the lead here. Start off. I'm Deadwind. Are you? Okay. Let's use the cannon method. Are we parallel? Nope, 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 nope. You're coming in for a little bonk, maybe? Oh, 
Oh, dude, we are so close together. Yeah, that's perfect. This is some high quality sailing. All right, if you straighten out. I'm straight, I'm straight. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, you're taking the lead. You are taking the lead. It just changed. We gotta go left. Yeah, I mean, you're just, you're, you're going so much faster than me. <laughs> I see you took a your, hole. your ass. <laughs> <laughs> Some water, you piece of shit. I'm dead wind again. I think you are as I well. I should be. Yeah. I should be. I got my cannon all the way to the right, and I'm just using it to see if you're going to outrun me here. I'm basically centered on your back mast. Yeah, you're outrunning me. Yeah, okay, which way do you want to turn the sails? Um, right go or left? left. I don't think it really matters, but... Left. Yeah, let's just do left. It'll... Oh my god. I think you're as you were doing that. So you're you're further out running me. So I should be able to catch up here. Yep, and I might be catching up. Does left have if there's the slightest bit of non headwind right? Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm catching up. I'm not running you. You are catching. You yep. are catching. And this is still deadwind, yep, okay. Still deadwind. I'm act this is I'm this actually is faster. Deadwind. Brig is faster than the sloop, no matter what you do with your boat, or where you sail, or how much razzmatazz you can conjure. It doesn't matter. If the brig knows what they're doing, they will catch you. Or if you're chasing the brig, if the brig knows what they were doing, they will run outrun you forever. If you like this video and you'd like to see some more sea of science videos ask a question in the comments or pop into chat and ask me a question if there's something you'd like to see as science i'd love to do more of these it was fun hanging with tally and really getting to the bottom of this it only took a couple of hours of sailing and you know a few few hours of video editing and, and stuff so it's not that big of a deal and if we can answer some questions that are currently subject to the telephone game rumor mill spread of of maybe misinformation maybe correct information that happens a lot in our community then let's do it it'll be fun so ask a question if you want us to science it and finally for next week's sea of thieves sea of science video we will be answering the question of whether or not the shrouded ghost exists and the way we're going to do that is by hunting down every piece of shit Meg, killing it, collecting its flesh, using the flesh to bait the shrouded, killing the shrouded on camera. And then we'll post that on Wednesday or, or whenever, whenever we're done. Hey,